And Jesus removes all barriers for us to worship God. He's clearing the way for all sinners to gather before God, no matter the location, no matter their ethnicity, no matter their sin. Jesus calls us to worship in spirit and in truth. The word worship means to be bowed down. And Jesus is calling us to live our lives bowed down to him. So that's what worship is. It's not just the hour on Sunday morning that we are together. It is, in fact, every minute of our lives. To worship in spirit means to live by the spirit and not by the flesh. But the flesh can be pretty enticing. But in our flesh, our passions and our appetites dictate our thoughts and actions. But in the spirit, God dictates our thoughts and actions. And finally, to worship in truth means to offer yourself as a living sacrifice. 